standing up straight, taking steps on his own. Keep breathing. Breathe through the whole thing, Mike. These are simple actions Michael Williams thought he would never do again. In 2009, Massive Mike, a former NBA basketball player turned bodyguard, was shot eight times in a nightclub. His wounds left him paralyzed. Since then, this six foot ten ex athlete has yearned to get back on his feet. I used to stand tall, I used to walk tall, act tall, be tall, I was tall. And I want to get back to that. And that's my determination to, to get back to that. Now, whatever it takes, I'll do it. Get me 75 here, Mike. Get me 75. Mm. You're Helping Mike there. along is Dan Ivankovich, an old basketball buddy from high school who became an orthopedic okay. surgeon. One last one. Let's see what he gets. <sighs> By chance, Mike saw Dan featured on a local television show yeah. and like, gave the doctor a call. The... Now Dan has designed a physical therapy program for his old friend right with incredible results. Yeah. Now we're, you know, we're talking 20, 30, 40 steps with a walker. This, this huge, huge progress, I mean, for a guy that was essentially being left for, for gone. Without his determination, without his stamina, without that fire in his belly to do this, n none of this would be possible. This is all on Mike. I'm, I'm here helping, but, you know, he's the one that got up and walked. A lifetime of intense athletic training has helped Williams power through his painful recovery. Dan hopes okay. to next outfit Mike with an experimental robotic exoskeleton that would allow him to leave his wheelchair behind for good. Massive Mike is still a long way from getting his old life back, but he's already making plans to reach out to youth attracted to the gang lifestyle. Through his experience, he hopes to show that the aftermath of gang violence isn't glamorous at all.